Hello and welcome to the learning square. In this video we will talk about the high pass filtering in the Fourier domain. So like before we will first create a mesh grid. Now remember we take the size 128 to 127 uh, minus 128 to 127 because our image size that we are talking about is 256 by 256 and matrix multiplication is possible only when the dimensions are same. Hence we take a size which is similar to our image cameraman image. Again I will create a circle now this time I will say C is equal to Z is greater than 50. So now to perform the high pass filtering in the frequency domain we keep the center values of the DFT and eliminate the others. I will again read my cameraman image. Perform the Fourier transformation on that image and perform the high pass filtering. We can use the FFT show function which we had made to see this value. So you can see Z is greater than 15 here. Now we will perform the inverse on this and I will use the IFFT show function which we had constructed to see the result of this. So this is how my output looks like. I can see the change by increasing the radii. So I can say for C is greater than maybe 50 and I'll just repeat all the steps. So I will say again multiply this we can just see this. So this is a bigger radii that we have used now. Again perform the inverse Fourier transform and you can see the difference. So again a ringing effect is seen in this which is considerably reduced in the bigger radii. Now to remove this ringing effect we can use the Butterworth filter which we will discuss in the next turn. So I will see you in the next one. Thank you.